The cochlea is a remarkable and complex structure within the inner ear responsible for converting mechanical vibrations generated by sound waves into electrical signals that our brain can interpret as sound. Let's explore its internal structure in more detail. The cochlea is a coiled, spiral-shaped structure resembling a snail shell. This shape is essential for its function as it allows for the organized processing of different frequencies of sound. It is divided into three fluid-filled chambers, scala vestibuli, scala media, and scala tympani. Scala vestibuli is the upper chamber, and it begins at the oval window. It contains a fluid called perilymph. Scala media, also known as the cochlear duct, is the middle chamber and houses the important sensory structures for hearing. It's filled with a different fluid called endolymph. Scala tympani, the lower chamber, terminates at the round window. It also contains perilymph. The basilar membrane runs through the cochlea, separating the scala media from the scala tympani. It plays a crucial role in the process of hearing. The width and stiffness of the basilar membrane change gradually along its length, creating a tonotopic map that allows different frequencies of sound to be processed at specific locations along the cochlea. The star of the show, the organ of corti, is found within the scala media and rests on the basilar membrane. It consists of thousands of specialized sensory hair cells arranged in rows. These hair cells are the actual receptors for sound and convert mechanical vibrations into electrical signals. The inner hair cells are arranged in a single row and are responsible for the majority of auditory signal transmission to the brain. They send electrical signals via the auditory nerve. The outer hair cells are arranged in three rows and are involved in amplifying sound vibrations within the cochlea. They help sharpen our hearing sensitivity, especially for soft sounds. Above the organ of corti is the tectorial membrane. This gel-like structure plays a crucial role in the hair cell's function by bending the hair cell's stereocilia when the basilar membrane vibrates in response to sound. The electrical signals generated by the hair cells are transmitted through the auditory nerve, to the brain's auditory processing centers. The round window, located at the base of the cochlea, is covered by a flexible membrane. It allows for the release of pressure generated by the incoming sound waves, helping to maintain the proper functioning of the cochlea. In summary, the cochlea's internal structure is a highly specialized system designed for the precise analysis of sound frequencies. Its spiral shape, fluid-filled chambers, basilar membrane, organ of corti, and hair cells all work together harmoniously to allow us to perceive a wide range of sounds and enjoy the sense of hearing. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you have any questions, please leave a comment below. And don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel, and also press the bell icon for more videos about science and biology.